So let's say you are given two sorted arrays and you need to find the median value of those two sorted arrays. So we know that the median value is going to be the value that separates the higher half from the lower half of a data sample. This is an extremely common problem and today we're going to solve it using JavaScript. Let's pseudocode this first. Okay, so in the problem we're given these two integer arrays. The first thing we need to do is concatenate the first array and the second array to create one large array with all seven values. And we can do that using the concat function in JavaScript. So now we are going to have a new array that's going to look like this. The next thing we need to do now that we have this array is to sort it so that we have all of the values from lowest to highest. And we can do this using the JavaScript sort function. Now the easiest way I can think of doing this is fi let's find out if there is an even or an odd number of integers in the array. Once we know this, we can find our median value because if we have an odd number of integers in the array, which we do right now, we know that the median is going to be the middle value, the value separating the lowest, the lower uh, integers from the higher integers. And if we have an even number, we need to take the number separating the lower, sorry, the two numbers separating the lower half and the upper half and find, uh, get the middle value between them. So for example, if we have an array that looks like this and we need to find the median value, we need to find the difference between, or the middle value between two and three. So we would just take two plus three divided by two and we know that our median value is going to be two and a half. And we just need to apply that logic in the conditional statements and we can get our result. Let's get coding. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we're gonna need to do, like we talked about while pseudocoding, is we're gonna need to concatenate both arrays. So I'm gonna create a new array equal to array one and array to concatenated. Oops. And now we need to sort this array. And we're going to just do this really simply using the JavaScript sort function. And this will make sure that we're sorting it based on uh, the values inside of the arrays. And for simplicity's sake, let's console log this out. So we can see our concatenated sorted array. And also for simplicity's sake, let's create a variable called length that is equal to the length of our new concatenated array. So this is where we need to determine, is this a, an, uh, an array with an odd number or an even number of integers? Because that's going to determine how we move forward. And we can do that uh, using modulus. So if length modulo two equals one. So if you divide length by two, will you have a remainder of one? We know it's going to be odd. So so now we know we need to take, we need to find what the 
uh, median uh, place is, and we can grab our median value from there. So we're going to return concat. We take length divided by two minus 0.5. So if we have our concatenate array, which is gonna have seven integers, we know that seven divided by two is three and a half. Three and a half minus 5, 0.5 is three. So we know that in position three, so the fourth number, is going to be the middle value. And for simplicity's sake, let's console this out. All right, so if it's not odd, we know that it's going to be even. And this is a little more confusing because we need to, if we have an even number, we need to split the difference between our lower half boundary and our upper half boundary. So to do that, we're going to return the middle number. So that's going to be length divided by two. So this is if we have seven, or sorry, if we have eight numbers in an array, that's going to be our fourth value. So the lower half plus the upper half, we're finding the average between these two numbers. So this is going to, this is the upper half, or sorry, the upper boundary. This is the lower boundary. And we're gonna divide it by two to get the average. And let's also print this out. And let's save that. Let's double check and make sure, didn't make any mistakes. And let's check to make sure it works. Awesome. So we have 1479258. And we know that if we were to sort these two arrays together, as we can see here, the middle value is five. Thanks for watching. And let me know if you have any problems you want to see done. And like and subscribe for more content.